If you want many audios now available on YouTube, you can support my Patreon page. Link in the video description. Without further ado, enjoy the video. Definitely needed that shower. I felt all gross and grubby. <laughs> Damn it, this peanut. You scared the daylights out of me. I forgot Rook took you in the dorm to babysit you. Speaking of Rook, where the hell is he? Shouldn't he be watching this thing? He's not answering my messages, so God knows where the hell he could be. Oh, this man, I swear. And as for you, how did you get in here? Unless you wandered in the shower room, which I'm sure you freaking did. What? You're staring at me intently. I know you can't speak, but give me a signal of what's wrong. <sighs> Are you trying to look innocent so I won't be mad at you? <laughs> Sorry to say this, darling, but that's not going to work. It takes a lot to make me give in. <sighs> well, I'm going to my bedroom to get myself dressed and do my evening skincare. <laughs> You're kidding me, right? This peanut's following me like some puppy. Are you lost? Can you not find Rook? If you can manage to navigate where I am, surely you can navigate where he is. That's a definite no. You can't come in my room. I'll be changing in there. And if you think for a moment you're going to see everything, you're wrong. Now run along to your owner's bedroom. That's in order. Shoo. Go. Go away. Shoo. Get. Oh, don't be like that. I didn't think you would have a clue of what I'm saying. Is this thing really emotional? Alright, alright. I'll make it up to you. After I'm dressed, I'm laying you in my room. Deal? Oh, you're really strange that you understood every word that I'm saying. At least this polyester potato will be well behaved. <laughs> Funny how I'm not the owner of this weird creature, but yet I managed to tame it. <sighs> Rook, I swear to the great sevens, you owe me big time. <laughs> Alright, you can come in now. Thank you for being patient. You're definitely Rook's other behalf. No matter how much of a handful you are, you're pretty adorable. It's not an animal. It's literally a moving stuffed toy. And I'm growing so attached to it. I'll probably be a little sad when the headmaster finds a way to take these creatures home. I remember seeing those things a while back. What are these things called again? I remember a pal bringing one here. <sighs> that rude thing thinks he's raised in a barn. <sighs> it's a truly of a handful. Are they called... Zooms? I suppose you like that name, judging your actions. <laughs> Ugh, stop being this adorable. It's too much for me. Vil, apologies if I'm breaking you up, but have you seen Monsieur Soum? Uh, there you are. I was wondering where you went. I was wandering around to look for you, but I figured you'd be hanging around with the Roy to Poison. <laughs> Alright, but showtime's over. I have to take you into my room, so let's go. 
come on. It's pretty strong for a small creature. It's like it's prying off a tick. Rock, is that you? We must see you're awake. Well, it was asleep until a certain someone started shaking the bed. Uh, felt like I was sleeping in a wave. Uh, where were you? You left me with this peanut. You're lucky I was able to tame this little one. I was looking for Monsieur Soom. I didn't think it would stay here in the dorm. Was it here the whole time? Correct. It was following me around. But since you like to be well-behaved and cute, I figured you wouldn't be difficult. Am I correct? <laughs> <laughs> How embarrassing. I thought it was lost around campus. I was looking far and wide to find it. At last, I shall take it to my room. <clears throat> Dear, it doesn't want to come. Maybe it's cold and that's why the poor thing was cuddled in my arms and under my comforter. Yes, but I don't want Monsieur Soom to disturb your slumber. Disturb my slumber? <laughs> that's very thoughtful of you, but it's only sleeping. Even if it's awake, it won't do anything but rest into my embrace. <laughs> or are you getting a little jealous? None. I wasn't getting jealous. Are you sure about that? You look a little jealous because it's sleeping into my arms when you, Rook Hunt, could be wanting this attention. Are you worried that you'll be replaced by a marketable plush? Oh, my grade sevens, you thought you were going to be replaced by a plush. <sighs> Climb in bed with me. What about Monsieur Sue? It can sleep in the bottom of the bed. I'm sure it'll wake up and crawl back up to us. <sighs> I can't believe you think that I'll be replacing you with a marketable plush. Kind of silly, don't you think? <laughs> I swear you get cuter every day. I'm cute too, right? Yes, you are. You're adorable and very attractive. Mm. Mm.